On March 14th, the full city council will finalize the decision on whether to ban bike lanes on Gillette Street or construct the bike lanes. On Tuesday night at a public hearing, the Judiciary and Administrative Committee voted down a resolution four to three. You know, you win some, you lose some. I, I, I thought it was important enough to uh, bring legislation to try to stop it. I was obviously on the losing end of that, and that happens. Um, but at least we got our say, and, and I think we voiced concerns that will be addressed. Scott Newminster, a member of the Lacrosse Common Council, introduced the resolution prohibiting bike lane construction on Gillette Street from Rose Street to Onalaska Avenue and leaving parking lanes on both sides of the street. Don't ban bike lanes anywhere in our city. On Tuesday, many community members voiced their opinion on the topic. But I just don't think that the Gillette Street is the right street. I think a side street might be a better option. I believe in the safety for the children. One thing both sides agree on is that Gillette Street is heavily trafficked with semis and cars, but also with children because of schools in the area. I think it makes the motorist, it makes them more aware that there are, are pedestrians and bikers out there. For my business, that parking out front is very critical um, and would take away from the business, but also just safety-wise. If the full council votes down the resolution, this summer construction will begin for a bike lane on Gillette Street.